Uh, today we, we are at Ojai Rally in California in Upper Campus. We are together with Tracy and I would like to ask your uh, a profile of your school. Yes, uh, Ojai Valley School uh, Upper Campus uh, is where we have our high school program. We have 110 students here from all over the world. Uh, most of our domestic students come from right here in California, uh, but we do have a lot of students that come from the western United States, but also from other countries. We are in this absolutely stunningly beautiful location in Ojai, California, which is uh, only about an hour, a little bit more north of Los Angeles. So we have this wonderful access to this huge cosmopolitan metropolitan city. Uh, we offer an excellent program of academics combined with athletics, uh, outdoor education, and the arts. We offer the opportunity for students to begin riding even in our younger grades at our lower campus and come right up on through and continue with their equestrian as a sport. The school owns about 60 horses and has stable facilities on both campuses. Our school's founding philosophy was built on the idea that um, we wanted to give children opportunity for a real um, hands-on learning, experiential learning environment and that we believed very strongly that, um, that they should have the opportunity to have a broad education that included academics but also the arts um, and the outdoors um, and character development. We really want students who are well prepared to go to college, not just in their studies but who they are as people. And uh, I'm sure that you have some international students. We do, we have many international students, about 24% of our student population between both of our campuses and we have about 300 students between our two campuses are international. This year from um, Germany and Finland and China and Thailand and South Korea and Taiwan and Mexico and Russia, um, I think about th Saudi Arabia, um, so I think about 13 countries are presented overall, so it's a very diverse community and we really have an opportunity to celebrate um, students' cultures um, and their backgrounds and that's a big part of, uh, of what we enjoy as part of our community. Day. We generally build in a prep period for each student so that they have some time during the day to either meet with the teacher for extra help, uh, to, to have a study hall time, um, and then after the academic day they go to sports um, every day, every afternoon, all our students participate in sports every day, every season, um, and then they've got some downtime in the evening, dinner, a two hour study hall, um, and then they've got some little bit more relaxation time and off to sleep and up again out of the next day. Oh, mm -hmm.